Hello! Based on the previous video, we will be displaying the year based on our date with these simple steps. Using the same app from the previous video, we will add the year next to our month column, which is based on the onboarding date column. Same as the month video, head over to the data section and let's add a new virtual column. I'll be naming it as year and use the following expression. Basically is year and your date column. So for my case, it will be year onboarding date. Let's save the progress. Now let's add the column in the table. For my case, the data table view. And adding the year column next to the month. By default, numbers usually comes with a comma separation. You can remove this by unchecking the show thousand separator. Now you can see the year column. Year is essential in your data set because it helps to separate your data according to the year. Here's an example. Now you can see your data systematically by year, which may assist you in a sound prescription later on. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Comment on what you would like to see next. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.